right. the real 12 tribes of the nation of Israel, right? right. Go ahead. And thou, even thyself, shall discontinue from thy heritage. So that's yeah. how we stopped following the law, right? We discontinued from our heritage. You know your heritage according to the Bible, brother? Huh? You an Israelite, you know that? What tribe you from? Yeah. Yeah? Mm. Shout out. Okay, right. come on. slave traders doesn't add up really because they didn't have the technology to be able to transport as many people as they said they did and at the same time do you think that we had since the children of Israel knew where Osiris was and the the tribe of Judah of oh, no excuse me the, um, yeah was it was, was it the, the tribe of Judah that was the northern kingdom and the southern kingdom so the southern kingdom knew where the northern kingdom went correct right and not all certain of certain people from the northern, like King James knew that they yeah, like the, the, the heads of the, the heads of the, the right. nations knew where the other tribes went. So right. Right. ultimately, that we wasn't lost to ourselves. You know, we was lost to the people that was trying to find us. You know, That's right. so ultimately, don't you think that like if we were uh, we was getting persecuted, persecuted all throughout Africa with Islam and all these different customs and tribes and religions that was going against us, and it was like really slaughtering of us. We congregated on the west coast of Africa, but the majority of us already went to the Americas. That's why they got people like you and me who look like the tribe of Judah, but actually are the tribe of Gad because we were already here. And we just was like, we colonized the western part of Africa ultimately. So that's what I'm saying. I'll explain it like this. There's two different kingdoms, right? So you got to understand, when the northern kingdom came over here, they looked like me and Houston. Exactly. You feel? So... Like, like many of us did, you feel? There, there were some of us that looked like like Assyrians and stuff. Gotcha. We, we was going off, Captivity. you understand? But mm. the vast majority of us, when Columbus came here, he said we had locks and copper skin. When you go into the Webster Dictionary, that's what Native American is, right? Uh, exactly. Like a copper skin person, exactly. right? So we, we looked like that when he came over here, you feel? Hey, one other, one, other, one other question I had. What's up? They, they said that, um, when the northern kingdom split from from the southern kingdom, uh -huh. that there was a remnant that actually stood with the stood with the southern kingdom. So right. not all of the northern kingdom went over exactly. to uh, captivity. All of the, right, so right, ultimately, right. like we have, like in, in the book, was it? Um, 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 Babylon and Timbuktu. Yeah, they, in that book, they say they yeah, got they different tribes, but all twelve tribes all throughout Africa to the right. same places that yeah, we yeah. congregated. We at. had a brother that came to Five Points one time who said he's Igbo, but his section of Igbo believes they're from the, the tribe of Ephraim. Right. So they would be around the, the southern kingdom, but he's really a northern kingdom Israelite. You feel right. what I'm saying? Right. So yeah, yeah, I feel what you're saying. But in regards to what you were saying first, there is a southern kingdom that looked like us that was taken in the Atlantic slave trade, right? And there are people that came over here and left, left West Africa and came over here too, that still look like us. But in 722 BC, there was also people that looked like us that was already over here, you feel? Or that exactly. came over here. So from King Solomon, he, they said that when they looked up the, the, the gold mines of Orphus, I don't know how to pronounce that that word, but the gold, yeah, the gold that he was looking up. They said that if you look it up inside the inside the what do you call it, the Jewish Encyclopedia, they said that this land could be associated also probably with Peru. So if King Solomon, he was the northern, he was a southern kingdom king, and he had gold mines over here, don't you think he left like people to protect that, and they had offspring, and you know the, the southern the southern tribes was here as well. So like, but that's also before the split. Because remember, there was a time, especially during the time of Christ, that the southern and northern kingdom didn't deal with each other at all. Right. The southern kingdom was calling them Gentiles and heathen. So you no. also got to keep that in mind too. That no, I'm just saying that even like if that. even if they didn't deal with each other, if I was the king of the southern, if I was the southern, if I was King Solomon, and we had gold mines in Peru, I'm gonna have my brothers be able to protect those now mines and be able to transport it. What he was trying to say was King Solomon was right before the split. He was the last king to have everybody together. Right. You know? So. Even if he did do that, he wouldn't have had uh, this. The southern kingdom would have no longer had control of the gold mines because they went to, to uh, Jeroboam in the northern kingdom. You feel me? Because they split. So, so do, do you think that like some of the but, people who actually? But then again, if he had gold mines here, I don't know if he actually left people here to guard them because the Bible says that when we came here, no man dwelt here yet. You feel? All right, all right. Like, break like, it down. Break it down. Break it down. All right. Check yourself, man. 
we were wearing fringes before the white man came to us, right? You, you can acknowledge that. Every every culture and every every culture that 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 was uh, that was established before the European language had its own dialect. But we were the only ones that spoke Hebrew, though. That's what I'm trying to tell you. No, Out that, of all the people that, that were colonized by the white man, that's we're the only ones that spoke a certain dialect. Us, the, us and the Latinos, we, we spoke the same dialect. That's why they that, had to give us two different languages to separate us. And they, they gave half of us Spanish and half every, of us English. No, listen, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Every every culture, or every tribe, Every back tribe then, has its own dialect, then, right? Had its own but, language. But how were they all able to communicate with each other if it wasn't all the same and derived from the same language? Though? That's what I'm trying to tell you. We were all able to communicate because it was all some form of Hebrew. That's that, that that's what I'm trying to get at. But check this out. Cause did this, the fringes come from the Bible. That's what I'm trying to show you. Read. No, no. This is the book of yeah. Numbers, Hold 15, on. Listen, listen, verse listen, 38. Listen, listen. Speak this, this unto the real. children of Israel Go ahead. and bid them that they make them fringes in the border of their garments. Right, in the border right. of their garments. Go ahead. Throughout the generations. I'm going to show you a picture. Go ahead. That they put upon the fringe of the border a ribbon of blue. A ribbon of blue, right? What color ribbon do they make us wear at the power? Yeah. Listen, listen, listen. The, Answer the, the question. Come on, blue is, is a stereotype. Answer the question. The fringes of blue is a stereotype. You, you guys think it's a stereotype because you don't know is. where it comes from no more. Oh, That's God. what I'm trying to tell you. No, no. If we listen, all knew that no, it came from listen. the Bible, it wouldn't be a stereotype no, no more. Listen, it would, it, can I speak? It can used I to speak? be a law. Go can ahead. I speak? Go ahead. The fringes of blue is a stereotype. The fringe, the blue is a stereotype. The blue, the, the truth of the blue is the form. Is, is the people that was born with with blue on their backs? Yeah. I understand. That's that's what I'm trying to tell you, bro. It's it's all doctrine. That it's all stories Na that Native we had to come Americans up with because none of us know where it comes Na from, bro. Oh, back up, back up. None of us knows where it comes from. He's, he's Native, Native Americans and people of color were born with blue on their backs naturally, not with fringes on their back. But the reason that it made us wear a border of blue is because that was what we were commanded to wear in the Bible. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Check this out. Hold on, hold on. What he means by blue on their back is we were born royal. Royal. royal being the, uh, blue being the color of royal. So we have like royal, royal blue. My, yeah, my right. Son, my, my, my son, my, my youngest son, <laughs> it's half Mexican, half Native American. I feel you. My son, I turned him over. I looked at, I looked at his, at his back, back, and he had blue on his back. That's how I knew he was my son. Bro. <laughs> I want to show you the picture of the ribbon of blue, so I could damn. I, I can't find it though. But look, 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 bro. This is our forefather, right? Look, look. look that's Gad right there. That, 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 that's a picture. He got fringes on. You feel? He got fringes on his clothes and a border of blue. You feel me? Because that's what we were commanded to wear in the Bible. If you go back, uh, Chief Joseph had on fringes in the border of blue. Freaking uh, the crow, right? Uh, Quano Parker. All these different natives. They all got fringes on, bro. Why right. are they wearing the fringes no. and why do none of us know where they Because they from? was born with blue on their back. But, but, but the reason we came up with that is because we forgot what the blue comes from. Read again. Uh, yeah. Yeah. The book of Numbers. Check it out. Check it out. Chapter 15, verse and 48. And then you give me Deuteronomy chapter 28, uh, verse 49. Because I, I want to show them colonization in the Bible too. It was prophesied that the white man was going to do what he did to us. Speak unto the children of Israel. Yeah, I got you. And bid them that they make them a fringes in the border of I'm sorry, the border of their garments right. throughout their generations. So make them fringes in the border of their garments throughout their generations. Go ahead. That they put upon the fringe a border, a ribbon of blue. Border and a ribbon of blue, right? Go ahead. And it shall be unto you for a fringe uh -huh. that you may look upon it. I remember all the commandments of the Lord. So that's what we're supposed to be wearing the fringes in the border for. But now we think that it has something to do with us being a royal people that was set apart. It was set apart because that's how we knew who we was. We, we put the fringes on you automatically. Like that's a native. He might not be from your tribe, but you know that's your people because he had fringes on. Shalom. That's why when the white man came here, they wanted to start putting fringes on. That's why they started that wild, wild west crap. Now yeah. they got jackets with fringes on them. They got jacket. jackets with the fringes on Swagger jacket. Culture vultures. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what they did. They wanted Culture to be us. Vultures. You understand what I'm saying? So. They wanted to be like people that was born. Right. Exactly. 
And but, but they can never be because they was never born with blue on their back. They weren't born with blue on their back, right? Because you're red. We're the chosen people up on the face of the earth. The, the Bible says that though, right? We, so, so, so you coming from the same point I'm coming from? Right. But that's all. That's all I gotta say. But what I'm trying to tell you is that point, though. That point isn't something that that the white man gave us. It comes from the Bible. They had to use the Bible to change the image of the people the, the that we got. The Bible is just the chronicle of the history that that was made at the white at the white person's point of view. No, no. hold on, hold on, hold that, on. That's hold what I'm trying to tell you. Look at, look at, look at, y'all laugh again. Look at, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, I speak first right. before y'all pass judgment. I'm not, I'm not passing look at, judgment. Look at, look at, look at. God and the white, the the white person's God will. Isn't y'all's God? No. Y'all born from Africa? No, we're not. Nah. We're from the I same place as you. I'm going to show you what my dad looked like. Yeah, hold on, hold on, brother. But you're not, you're not putting two and two together. This no, Bible, listen. This I'm Bible, putting three and three together. Listen, listen. Listen, what, pops, listen hold on, hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on. The, the, the point that the brother tried to make to you earlier, right? Is that, well, what stone you said again? Uh, Lost Luna Stone. The Lost Luna Stone. The Bad Creek Stone. All these are Native American stones, right? That they gave as a peace offering to the so-called white man who burned every peace treaty he ever did, right? Just like he still did with Standing Rock because he's a bastard, right? They was writing those stones, right, in the same in the same uh, language that the first ever Bible was written in. This is an English rendition of the Hebrew, the same type of Hebrew that's found on the Native American stones. That's what we're trying to tell you. This is not a white man's book. This is a book, book that the white man stole, just right. like he stole your land, brother. Come on. All right. Stop. Stop. Oh, listen, bring listen, that listen. Up. All right, all right. The, the Bible was pushed upon Native Americans by the white culture, yes. right? Yes, yes. So, so, the Bible is not, and every God mentioned in the Bible is not a fucking Native American. Here's the thing, though. No, 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 no. Look, look. The white man took God. the Bible. No, no, check it out, check it out, check it out. The white man took the Bible, right? That was already, we already and, had the Bible. And what they did was they pushed, pushed on, it on every culture. Check it out, though. Every, every. Listen, listen to me, though. The reason they had to take the Bible and push it, right, is because they knew it was ours already. They had to change our mind frame of what the Bible was. So what they did was, look, check it out. There's a certain language that we learned to read the Bible in. That's what the brother was telling you. It was Hebrew, Paleo Hebrew. That's what we wrote the stones in. If you got a phone, you could Google any of those stones and it's gonna be in the possession of Native Americans. And it's gonna be in Paleo Hebrew, the same Hebrew that the Bible was written in, right? The first Bible, but before any white man got their hands on it. Moses, right? The Hebrew Moses was speaking. The Hebrew Jesus was speaking. Hold on, let, let me finish. So, so what I'm trying to tell you is, is this Hebrew that we were speaking back then, right? That the first Bible was written in, that we were able to speak, that we had put on our stone. This Hebrew is the Hebrew that the white man doesn't have access to. You understand me? So, with that being said, you have to take the fact that we had that Hebrew, that we're the only people that have possession of it, right? And the fact that they took the Bible and pushed it on us, why would they have to do that and then change the language? Change the images of those people, right? They pushed it upon every side What, what about the Bible? Here's the thing though. Did, did, did they push? Answer me this question. When they were teaching Native Americans, right? First of all, they didn't. Yeah, hold they on. had to teach. Check me. Check me out. They had to this teach. is why. Let me explain because, to you. Hold on. Let, let, let me finish. Had their own let, let me finish. Let, let me explain it to you. Right. Our culture why still came from the Bible, right? No, no, not mm -hmm. everybody's culture. All of ours did, bro. I'm trying to tell you. Look, my, my dad is Comanche, right? His mom is Cherokee and Blackfoot, right? So I have three different tribes in my family. You feel me? I only got one different tribe. I only got two tribes. And both of them say the same thing. God did, God did not exist in America until Columbus came. That's not true. That's not true. That means that we forgot who we were. That means your people forgot who they were. Because no, where did you get the fringes from? The fringes came from God. I just read it to you. So why are we wearing those if God didn't exist? Where did the Hebrew come from? Where did our languages come from? That's all I gotta say about that. I'm not gonna argue about that. God did not exist in America until the white man came. He did. His name was Yahweh. Don't that sound like Hebrew? Yeah. Don't, don't that sound like native? No. Yahweh. No. Yahweh. The, the, the Yahweh. No. The Yahweh. The that, that, that's his name. That's the his creator. name. That's what we call him. Yahweh. Yahweh. The Great Spirit. The Great Spirit. That's what he's talking about. That's your God. Yahweh. 
But that's it. That's what his name is in the Bible. The Y H W H, bro. They had to change that. You know what they changed it to? They made his name God. They, his son's they, name was Yahweh Shah. They created. You know what they changed it to? They created a, a they, white man, and they changed his name to Jesus. They created. They that, created. That's how they pushed the Bible on us. The that's Bible the, says that, we are above all they, people. That's how they. Pre, that's how they pushed the Bible on every every race. Right. But but they had to specifically do it to us because the Bible they was ours. For, no, for the them to Bible take our land, nobody. it was ours. Hey, the Bible was nobody. Go ahead, read it. The book of Jeremiah, 17, verse 4. Read this. Look, check and this thou, even thyself, shalt discontinue from thy heritage. So, look, look, we discontinued from our heritage. That what? The I gave thee. That the Most High gave us, right? Because we had these fringes on. We came over here wearing these fringes just yeah, just came. Stay in Listen to yourself. Came. Over here, from another country. Yeah, we came, came from Israel. Came, came. That, your, that, that. Your, your people too. That's what I'm trying no, to tell you. No, my people were all. Nobody's here. from here. No. Nobody's hold on, from hold on, here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. My people were already Nobody's here. Nobody's from hold here, bro. We all came here at the same time. Your people and and my dad's people, my mom's people came later with them on slave ship, 1619, right? But our people came 722 BC. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, brother, 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 brother. That's a lie, bro. Why? Listen, why? Why does uh, uh, the, uh, the, the the Mexicans in South America, even some parts of America, they keep on the low? Why do they have pyramids? The same pyramids that you can find in Africa. Because, because the same people that 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 tried to discover America came here at the time before, pushed the Bible of the Bible of. No, I'm talking about the pyramids, brother. I'm talking about the pyramids in Mexico, the pyramids in South America, the even the certain pyramids that's over here. The same, the same reason I'm fucking telling you why they 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 got pushed, they got they got pushed religion upon them by by the people from another country to. Suppress them that that the Mayans had their own pyramids. Nobody made them do that. They had their own pyramids, brother. The Mayans had the Mayans had better pyramids than the Egyptians, brother. Don't let them fool you. So why is that? Check this out. Let me tell you why. Because the same people that built the pyramids in Egypt came over here and built the pyramids. Check this out. I'm Native American and and before 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 Columbus came. God did not exist. Before Columbus came, there was pyramids. Explain that. Hey, that that's South America. This is North America. My people are from North America. But there, there's also pyramids here, brother. They just don't tell you. Look up, look up hey, the Google listen, North listen. American pyramids. Look at North American py pyramids hey. are mounds and mounds. Hey, Check this out. Mounds are burial grounds for the Native American people that were here. And pyramids North. are burial grounds for the Egyptians. So why? How did that information no, no, get passed you, out? No, no, you just answered my question. Yeah. You, you just answered my pyramids. Egyptians never came here. No, listen, 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 listen. Yeah. Listen, Mexican people, Mexican people, their their mounds were pyramids. Get out. Get out. We said never came. No, that's right. Mounds were pyramids. And how did they get here? Hey, you see get out? Because get out. That, 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 that was their religion. Okay, where did they get that from? They got that from their religion, from their ancestors. And where did the ancestors come from? From wherever the fuck it came yeah. from. I ain't Israel. Israel! Israel! That's what we're trying to say. Hey, I ain't fucking Mexican. I'm Native American, okay? Exactly, but they're still. There's still pyramids in North America. There's still hey, people in North America. Pack? Huh? Huh? Don't natives do a blood brother pack? Hell no. Shit, man. We do gangster pack. You ain't heard of that, though? Oh, he going there. How you used to tear our Probably. arms and do the blood brother pack? Yeah, man. We, we, we you solid, that? man. We solid, man. My people, huh? my people. Do you know where that handshake come from? Say, we solid. We gangster. Huh? It's not from being gangsters though, but first it's Jake. It's Jake. It's Jake. No, I mean, my dad ain't that to you. Look at you, Randy. Chapter 33. That, 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 that's called. That's called so, that's called verse so, 20. So we have so, 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 solidarity right now. Right, yeah, it is solidarity. Now check it out. I'm going to tell you where I come from. And of Gad, he said, Blessed be he. Look at that. What's that? That's Gad right there. You feel me?
feel? Yeah. Blessed be he that enlarged Gag. Blessed be he that enlarged Gag, because we got the biggest part of the land right here, right? North America, right? Go ahead. He dwelleth as a lion. We dwelleth as a lion right here in North America, right? Because we gangsters, like you just said, right? <laughs> and right. tear the arm with the crown of the head. We tear the arm with the crown of the head, right? We tear the arm, man. And then we put that crown on our head, that, that war bond. You feel what I'm saying? The crown of the That's head. That's in the Bible, bro. Moses yeah. is talking about this. This is Deuteronomy. Go ahead. Verse 21. And he provided the first part for himself. He provided the first part for himself. That's why we got the biggest part of the land out of all the natives here. Right. We got North America. Right. we the ones that chose this place. That's right. Yeah. But it's not because we was born here. We had to come here and take it for ourselves. That's right. Feel? The Bible talks about this. All right, break it down. Because down they're in a portion of the lawgiver. I know where I come from. I know where I come from. You one of the chosen people of the whole planet, not just North America. That's, that's, right. Right. that's right. That's right. That's right. Break that out. out. Break that out. I know my background. Oh Nobody tell me where the fuck yeah, they yeah, think bro. I know why. It's I'm more than just North America, bro. That's all I'm trying to tell you. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You know what? Well, what are we saying? North, North America, South America, hey, it's all America. The whole earth. The whole earth belongs to you, brother. The whole earth is yours, bro. And he came with the hands of the people to the whole earth. Can I get that precept? Yeah, get the get the precept, Bob. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, hold on. Native American. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You got a smartphone? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You got a smartphone? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You got a smartphone? What? Huh? You got a smartphone? Some what? This guy. What the fuck are you talking about? Hey, you got a smartphone? You got an iPhone? You got a smartphone? Shit, man. I'm Gexa. I don't need no smartphone. Hey, let me get you. Don't throw that out. Don't 